everyone welcome back to my channel we are here with another daily practice exercise video i hope you all are having fun with the past patterns that we are seeing now what are we going to do today in the last video we saw how to sing the pattern from sa to sa from higher sa to lower sa right sa ni sa sa ni da ni sa we saw that pattern now we are going to try that in akara okay that is our task today before that let's set our shruti in scale a and then let's get into the video before we start off let's sing the normal swaras starting from lower sa because that will be our foundation before you start any pattern right it's always better to sing the actual notes like the sa re ga ma pa da ni sa normally and have a round of that like sa re ga ma pa da ni sa sa ni da pa ma ga re sa sing it so that that will give the foundation for you to start your pattern uh, it is not a good practice to start your pattern directly you can do it if you are very well versed but it is always good to start off like drawing the outline right before getting into the detailing we draw the outline so singing the normal notes will help you draw the outline so that you stay within your raga so that is why we sing it so let's just try and sing sa re ga ma pa ga ni sa sa ni da pa ma ga re sa beautiful now you know okay i'm going to sing in this ragam so i'll i'll not go beyond or i'll not go off or flat in this ragam when i sing my pattern so that is why singing this is very important now coming to our pattern what was our pattern last week sa ni sa sa ni da ni sa sa ni da pa da ni sa sa ni da pa ma pa da ni sa sa ni da pa ma ga re ga ma pa da ni sa sa ni da pa ma ga re sa re ga ma pa da ni sa this was our pattern right now we are going to try this in akara what is akara replace all your notes sari gama all those things into a that's it ha 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 beautiful now if you notice i am hitting each and every note i say this in all the akara videos it is very important to hit your note ha sa ni sa you can actually hear those notes right ha actually hear that right so it is very very important to hit each and every note that is what is going to give you grip towards your notes okay always remember this and let's try and sing the same pattern in akara in a little faster pace ha Now let's build the tempo and try it. Ha ah, sa ni sa. Let's try in that tempo. Sa ni sa, sa ni da ni sa, sa ni da ba da ni sa. Let's try in that tempo. Ha ah, 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 ha 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 ha. Beautiful. But. when i try to sing right sometimes i get stuck i kind of think okay what should i sing now or uh, am i missing something or am i missing off some notes right so when you have such doubts it's okay you stop it 
in between sing the swaras and then you continue with your akara practice you might face this in the initial stages after you get used to it it will automatically come but yeah during initial practice you might definitely face this so in this cases you stop you sing the actual swaras and then you get back to your akara for example ah ah Now I'm lost. Sani da ba ma ga, sani da ba ma ga ma pa da ni za, sani da ba ma ga ma pa da ni za. So this is what I was missing. Ah, now it came very easily. So that's how it is. It's it's a very simple thing. It is there is no rocket science. It's very very simple. You just have to sing the actual notes and then come back to your akara. Now let's try it again. Ah, ah, practicing this uh, it might be a little tough but it's okay uh, we'll practice and we'll get there so continue to do this and uh, and if you have any doubts please do put that in the comment sections below i'll definitely see it i'll definitely answer all your questions okay and i will see you in the next video happy practicing happy learning and don't forget to tag me on instagram if you put any reels okay see you and i'll see you in the next video